right now, and today San Mateo County is going to talk about legislation to stop the expansion of Waymo. Yeah, into the county there. Some local officials want local governments to have more control over whether autonomous vehicles operate on their streets. Crown Force Will Tran is live in Redwood City with the latest. Good morning, Will. What's going to happen is the Board of Supervisors for San Mateo County, they probably want to put a do not enter sign on the streets in certain cities in San Mateo County and give them the ultimate call whether or not those driverless cars will be allowed within their city. Right now, it's up to two agencies, the CPUC, the California Public Utilities Commission, as well as the DMV. They say, according to Supervisor Dave Canepa, he says they don't even consult with local jurisdictions on whether or not those cars should be allowed within their city and their county. He is saying they want the cities to decide, especially after all the pushback that's been happening recently against those driverless cars. He pointed to an accident that happened just last week in San Francisco where a cyclist and a Waymo car got into an accident. And despite the investigation still ongoing this time, almost instantly so many people said it was Waymo's fault. So you get the pushback on those driverless cars, not to mention in San Francisco, currently the DMV has suspended their operation for crews, allowing them to drive within San Francisco. That has been suspended. The meeting will happen at 10 o'clock this morning. They're just planning to introduce the resolution. It still has time to make it through all of the lawmakers. But again, this is one step forward on the pushback against those driverless cars. And this time, it's happening in San Mateo County. Back to you. Okay, thanks a lot, Will.